make whistling rockets with sparks, stars, explosions. The whistling composition is already known to us from the previous video. We will learn how to make rockets. Formulations based on sodium salicylate require less pressing. <laughs> All components must be thoroughly dried and crushed. The powder particles should be less than 0, 2 millimeters. Vaseline is best dissolved in gasoline or another solvent. Attention! The solvent must completely evaporate from the mixture before using it. We fill the composition into a plastic tube. Insert a wooden piston. Then, using a clamp, press the mixture. Repeat the operation with a new portion of powder. Pressing is a universal method, but then we will learn how to do without it. The smaller the diameter of the tube, the less pressing. At 10 millimeters, you can do with your hands. More than 15 millimeters will require a press. Attach a wooden stick as a stabilizer. It is important that the center of gravity of the rocket is outside the fuel. Insert the fuse. It is necessary to fix the fuse well, otherwise it may fall out. At first I made rockets without a stabilizer and set them on fire from the side. I believe the guide rod would be enough. So I made a stabilizer out of a Chinese chopstick. <laughs> to make the composition whistle well, you need a plastic tube, and it's not easy to get it. So I decided to try disposable syringes. We throw away the needle, the piston will still come in handy. Cut off the tip under the needle and we seal it with tape or just paper. Pour the composition, and we press it without fanaticism. Repeat the operation until the tube is about two-thirds full. Be sure to leave an empty space, otherwise the rocket will not whistle. We cut off the stop, now it is not needed, it will interfere with the flight. Before inserting the wick, I press nitrocellulose, it does not allow the composition to get enough sleep and sets it on fire more reliably. We did it without pressing. Let's try to make a whistling rocket and a sparkling tail. After the whistling composition, flash powder can be poured into the end of the rocket. Yeah! 
Let's try to attach a star. You can stick a paper cap on the star for its safety. The rockets look quite heavy. I hope that my fuel will lift such rockets. Attach the firecracker to the rocket. The stabilizer from a Chinese chopstick is already too light for this rocket. <laughs> Due to the slow fuse, the firecracker explodes too late. In the future, I used a fast fuse. Hot glue seemed to me more convenient than scotch tape. Hot melt adhesive looks more aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> sodium salicylate suited me quite well, but let's try to make whistling rockets on sodium benzoate because most pyrotechnics use it. One rocket took off, one exploded. The composition on sodium benzoate needs more dense pressing. Instead of sodium benzoate, you can probably use aspirin, but I couldn't launch rockets on it.